All right, guys, yo, what's up? We're back here with another video, and we're now gonna do a re rework on the blazer because we previously ran it. Is we don't got footage of it, but we ran it. We gave it a little test run, and it was leaking through the the back intake gasket. So now what we gotta do is um take the whole intake out and then fix the gasket, do all that work, and then should stop all the leaks and that should be it for the day we're gonna be getting that done and seeing what else we can get done in the process too and let's see where we're at all right guys yep. see you stick stick to the video Oh, we just took it out, guys. Right now we're about to um we're about to redo the gaskets, put them all back together, and then we're gonna put it back on and take it off for a spin. <laughs> All right, guys, we got it back running again. Now uh, we fixed the oil leak it got. The head over here in the back. It was leaking through the back and it was going to the starter. We fixed that oil leak. And yeah, we got it back running now. And we're going to drive it now. And for you guys to see it, because we're already finished with it. I don't know if I showed you guys in the video. I'm going to show you when we drive it down there. We fixed, now it's shifting through here. It's yep. first, second third and fourth right there and then that's the um the red one is the converter to lock yeah. it up um but we did it through here because um when we, we drove it at first they didn't want to um switch gears they stayed stuck in the high gear and it was because um the transmission with the computer wasn't working good so we still got to take this whole cable out with the computer we're not using that now because we went carburetor and yeah, we're about to drive it right now and I'll get back with you guys. All right guys, my brother um driving his truck. He's hurt. Driving for the first, no, not the first time. It's like our third time or fourth already. But now look, now we're switching with the gears. Did you heard it, second. nothing to do that's the only thing we need now is just get the um the exhaust that's pointing out the hood like that we're gonna route them out to the fender yeah we're gonna reroute them back now to the fender and i think that should do it that and then we're gonna get a cam for it a cam and we're gonna get a better um carburetor for it because we got a four barrel carburetor of rochester but the main the main um holes are small and then the the secondary ones are big, so I'm trying. I'm gonna get. A, we're gonna get a carburetor. But my brother is. He's gonna. We're trying to. 
trying to get one for um like a holly or uh what was the other one it was a holly or oh the edel broke something like that but yeah guys we still got a, a little bit more things to do for it before we go to the drag strip because we're going soon because my when i finish my crx um we're gonna do the windshield and um plexiglass not plexiglass it's um what was it polycarbonated um lexan yep get it. 